My name is Kathy Cornejo, and I will be presenting the 2020 Department of Social Work Student Awards, BSW Awards. The Outstanding BSW Graduate Award is presented to the undergraduate student who has demonstrated excellent leadership skills through work in a student organization for the social work department or within the broader community. This award is given to Caitlin Bittinger. Caitlin's field placement was at the Mason and Partners Free Clinic where she was part of an interprofessional team providing case management and support for patients and team members, making sure patients' basic needs are met and bridging them to a permanent medical home when indicated. In addition to providing services to patients, Caitlin has been very involved with expanding the reach of the clinic by regularly attending and participating in community events. Caitlin is a team player who is always willing to help. The BSW Writing Award. This award is presented to a senior BSW student in recognition of excellence in the preparation of a written paper or other written form of scholarship. This award is given to Ellie Carlson. Ellie shows high levels of critical thinking in her writing, which is essential in this field. She shows focus, clarity, organization, engagement, eloquence, and honesty in all of her assignments. She exhibits high levels of professionalism in her writing with an ability to make the reader want to learn more. BSW Academic Excellence. This award is given to the student who demonstrates excellence in academic performance exemplified by their commitment to scholarship, academic achievement, integrity, dedication to the profession, and intellectual curiosity. This award is given to Haido Ayala. Haido applies critical thinking and clearly expresses his ideas in his writing. His papers are well organized with logical flow of concepts and always read very well. Outstanding BSW Field Student. This award represents outstanding achievement during the senior field practicum experience. This student embodies high standards of integrity, character, and commitment to social work values and ethics. In addition, this student has demonstrated professional competence, willing to take advantage of learning opportunities, supervision, and engaging critical thinking when serving clients. This award is given to Emma Gonzalez. Emma Gonzalez interned with the City of Alexandria's Department of Community and Human Services. She is one of the few BSW students who've interned in a public child welfare setting and has shown an unwavering work ethic and quickly learn the practice and policy complexities of child welfare work. The BSW Advocacy Award is given to the undergraduate social work student who goes beyond the requirements of a class assignment or field practicum expectation to advocate for an issue supporting a vulnerable population or group. This award is given to Maritza Hina. Maritza has demonstrated high levels of tenacity and a commitment to advocacy while taking Social Work 483, Social Work, and Social Media, the hashtag movement. Maritza aptly incorporated coursework about virtual social activism to launch a live social media campaign called Justice Para Maria. Maritza's social media campaign was used to highlight attention to an unsolved homicide case involving her late aunt. The BSW Leadership Award is given to a student who has improved the quality of life for the student body and engaged other students in service to the department, college, university, or wider community. This award is given to Samantha Gurr. Samantha has a history of providing exceptional leadership both inside and outside of academia. Over the past several years, she has served as secretary and vice president of the Undergraduate Social Work Student Association, Vice President for Active Minds, which is an initiative to reduce mental health stigma across campus, and has served as a resident advisor to students in dormitory settings. 
In addition, Samantha has been an executive planning member with the American Foundation of Suicide Prevention, worked in the community as an advocate for affordable housing, and has mentored exceptional children in multiple settings. The MSW Writing Award. This award is presented to a specialist year MSW student in recognition of excellence in the preparation of a written paper or other written form of scholarship. This award is given to Alice Zick. Alice has demonstrated her excellent writing ability by analyzing, integrating, and discussing difficult and complex materials and subjects. Alex is thoughtful, perceptive, and intelligent in her approach to the world, social work, and her studies. And this carefulness comes through in her writing. The MSW Leadership Award. Recipients of this award were nominated for demonstrating an enthusiastic commitment to leadership and service to the department, the college, the university, and the larger community. Three MSW students were nominated, Linda Munoz, Elizabeth Mallon, and Stephen Andrews. Linda, Elizabeth, and Stephen were interning at the Mason and Partners MAP Clinics, realized that many of the food donations given to MAP Clinics for their patients were not very culturally sensitive to the Latinx population. These students conducted a culturally sensitive food drive between October 7th and November 18th, 2019, with the goal of collecting food that is familiar and enjoyed within the Latinx community. They gave several presentations within the Mason community to highlight the identified need and to solicit food donations. Their efforts were successful, estimating that this food drive fed approximately 25 families, affecting 75 individuals. During the spring semester, they conducted a toiletries drive to promote personal hygiene within the populations they serve. The MSW Advocacy Award is given to the graduate social work student who goes beyond the requirements of a class assignment or field practicum expectation to advocate for an issue supporting a vulnerable population or group. This award is given to Jasmine Jazz Jackson. Jazz put her advocacy skills to work in an effort to increase the number of electives offered by the department during the spring 2020 semester. Knowing that her classmates were frustrated, she organized a petition drive resulting in 80 signatures. She agreed to speak for her classmates in a meeting with the MSW program director where she argued her case presented the petition, and comported herself professionally, a great example of advocacy close to home. The Outstanding MSW Field Student. This award is presented to an MSW student who has demonstrated an outstanding performance in the field during the specialist year in the program. This student exhibits exemplary professional character and is able to manage challenges with strength, compassion, and humor. In addition, the student models the values and ethics of the social work profession and a strong commitment to social justice. This award is given to Rhea Vance Chang. Rhea utilized supervision effectively, had good interactions with clients, was reliable, ahead with earning field hours, and made sure that she was meeting learning agreement measurable learning activities and had a great working relationship with her supervisor. Rhea's work continued to be thorough throughout the semester, well thought out, and met all expectations. The MSW Academic Excellence Award is presented to an MSW student at the conclusion of the specialist year. This award honors a student who has demonstrated outstanding academic performance, leadership, field work, and potential for professional achievement. This award is given to Laura Nathan Fortuna. Laura's papers were always intelligent, well-written, and demonstrated critical thinking. She always came to class well-prepared and participated. In addition, she assisted in department candidate searches last summer by attending presentations and offering helpful feedback. 
Outstanding MSW Graduate. This award honors a student who has demonstrated outstanding academic performance, leadership, field work, and potential for professional achievement. This award is given to Adriana Lopez Piper. Adriana has demonstrated a consistently strong commitment to the breadth of her work in the MSW program and has excelled particularly in developing meaningful relationships with community partners. Adriana is an excellent problem solver and manages her many responsibilities very well. She makes value added contributions to class and in the field and will make a significant impact in the profession when she graduates. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I knew you could do it. I'm so proud of all of you. You have definitely developed the greatest superpower of social workers, flexibility in times of crisis. I, it has been my honor to have been a part of your time here at Mason, and I look forward to your continued success. Onward and upward, please stay in touch with us and be bold, be courageous, and be your best. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations to the class of 2020. You did it. We're really proud of you. One of the things about social workers is that we learn to adapt. And you've done that very well. You've had to adapt to a lot of changes due to the pandemic, but you've done it and you've come to the end of this semester and your graduation. You should be proud of yourself. We are proud of you. Congratulations class of 2020. I hope everyone feels super proud of this huge accomplishment. Um, I know I feel so grateful to have been on this journey with you all. So while I'm sad to leave Mason, I know that the social work field just gained some incredible individuals who are so dedicated to helping others and changing the world. Best of luck, woo! Hello, class of 2020 graduating BSW and MSW students. I just wanted to say congratulations. I'm so proud of you guys. I think you should all be really proud of yourselves. Um, you've done a lot of great work. I've had the privilege of teaching you and I think the social work profession has the privilege of having you in the profession. So keep up the good work and look forward to seeing you in the field. Take care. Hello, I am Dan Friedman, BSW Program Director. I want to take this opportunity to congratulate all 2020 BSW and MSW graduates. It is such a proud moment for all of you and for those who have supported you along your journeys. I wish you all nothing but happiness and joy moving forward. And again, congratulations, class of 2020. Hello, class of 2020. It's my pleasure to congratulate you on all that you've accomplished. You should feel so proud of all of the good work that you've done, all the studying, all the laughing, all the writing, all the studying. <laughs> and um, I know that you will be uh, fabulous social workers. I'm so excited to see um, what you will be doing um, in the field. Um, as you can see, I'm standing in front of Robin's Egg Blue Doors and that's welcoming you so much into the future. Um, big hugs and congratulations. Hello, 2020 graduates. This is Kathy Pruden from the FIELD program. Your hard work, perseverance, and flexibility have gotten you to this exciting point. We are proud of you and wish you great success in your social work career. Congratulations. I'm so excited to be here today to celebrate each of you. Congratulations, MSWs. Whether we met while I was adjunct faculty or perhaps over this last year as MSW program director, I want to say it has been an honor to be part of your journey and to be part of your community. 
Thank you. Welcome to the field, professional social workers. Congratulations. Congratulations, social work graduates of 2020. I am looking forward to having you as colleagues and alumni of our program. Good luck as you go forward and do great things. Congratulations again. Hello, graduates of 2020. Congratulations and good luck. We are so proud of all of our BSW and MSW graduates. Go out there and do great work and come back and visit us often. And I am inspired by my fellow classmates as well as the clients that I'm serving um, at my practicum site. Um, working with people living with um, neurodegenerative disease has really helped me to understand ways that I can serve in the community as well as the needs of a diverse population. I am inspired by everyone who helped me get to where I am today. You know who you are. Thank you. I'm inspired by all that I've learned here at Judge Mason, and I hope that I can bring big, big smiles to faces with any steps that I'm taking. I'm inspired by all the students I've had the opportunity to meet, um, all the faculty that I work with and have taught me here at George Mason University, and by the field of social work um, for all that uh, social workers do. So, a boy was throwing starfish into the ocean, and a man walked up, and he pointed to all the starfish, and he said, there's no way that you can possibly save all of them. And then the boy picked up another one and he threw it in and he said, I made a difference to that one. That's what inspires me. I'm inspired by um, children's capacity to learn and grow and change and overcome a lot of difficult situations. And um, I am hoping that I'm inspiring um, some feelings of self-love and compassion um, and community. And I'm inspired by people who face hard circumstances in life, yet are still vulnerable and optimistic about their future. And I hope to inspire compassion. I'm inspired by my mom. She taught English language and high school equivalency courses to migrant farm workers in the Midwest during the 1970s. I hope to inspire new social workers to serve these populations and to continue social works legacy of fighting poverty. I am inspired by the wonderful classmates that I have and the faculty that are inspiring me to be a better social worker. Um, I am inspiring and encouraging future social workers. And I am inspired by um, all the other social workers in the social work department at Mason and everyone who has helped me um, get to where I am today because I really enjoy helping other people and I've learned a lot about um, being with others and just understanding different perspectives and everyone has a unique um, life. Um, and I am inspiring and encouraging others by um, providing um, like my perspective and also making sure that everyone feels like they have a voice through um, my practicum and my jobs and wanting to work with um, the youth. So. 
I'm a geographer here at Shor Geography major at Shores Mason, and I work with a social worker in a clinical setting. And she works with people with special needs, especially autism. And that's how I am inspired by her because she's really nice and she helped me a lot 